Yo, 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 yo. What up? It's your boy Isaac Anzu, the lyrical chimerical, clerical chimerical, erical, flerical, magical, tragical, in between the aglets, in between your mind, finding time to make the rhymes, the chimera with the voice of the era. Isaac Anzu. What's up, Incorporation Nation? Ooh, we are back in the studio today doing some music writing. <laughs> Finally! It's been so long since we wrote music. Doing one music writing stream a week, honestly, I like it. <laughs> and, <clears throat> uh, you know, uh, a Hollow Live VTuber by the name of <clears throat> Sarah Fauna did a rap writing stream recently. So, uh, if that's what's trending, let's do it. <laughs> because we are all about business here. It's not a coincidence that my rap writing stream that I talked about last month just so happened to, to coincide with her stream. We are following trends. <laughs> no coincidence. Anyway. Um, so today we are going to be writing Hugo rap. And I am I have I have a prepared statement because I, I'm sure people are going to come on stream and ask me the question. What the fuck is a fugue? Well, it is a classical form in which a melody intertwines with itself. <laughs> Good shit. Good shit. So, <clears throat> as with all rap writing streams, uh, even the classical ones, we got to start with the beat. Uh, so let's go to... Uh, I want this to feel bombastic. Uh, so let's go to our acoustified kits and just see what we got. Oh, when they say bombastic, they mean reggae. But that's okay. I think to make the fugal rap work, we will need a slightly, how should I say this, slower, slower beat. Actually, this is kind of sick. Yo, it's Isaac Anzu with the flow. Everybody knows that this chimera's got the voice of the era and everyone wants to see this guy rap like a fugal style guy. Bach, Beethoven, and Rams. Everybody knows that they are the bomb. And if you want rhymes, then I'm who you're missing. And if you want girls, then I am. Wait. <laughs> Don't clip that. Uh, no, that goes in, in, in MIDI. Wait, no. <laughs> Actually, that's, that's kind of, uh, no, no, no. You get your own, you get your own thing. Yes. The electrified kit. Now, last time we wrote classical rap. Oh, let me just save this. Let me just save this bad boy to the desktop. Um, yeah. Uh, last time we wrote classical rap, we didn't start from zero. We wrote a uh, classical rap to the stylings of Mozart. And I think I want to do the same here. Sorry for the flashbang, but we are going to IMSLP. And we 
we are going to look for fugue. Category, fugue. Poifect. They're in... Alphabetical order? <laughs> uh, the question is, we should probably do a Bach fugue, right? So really, let's go to... Uh, B is for Bach, Johann Sebastian Bach, because he wrote just an absolute shitload of fugues. What we're looking for is one that's kind of um, singable. Fugue is not singable. My uh, <clears throat> my wife Lumi has suggested the Nakata and Fugue in D minor. What? No, that's that's the G minor one. All right. I guess let's go look at the Takata and Fugue in D minor. Um, do you know if it's BWV 538 or 565? I'm guessing 538. I understand. Oh, that's the original score. Sorry, I didn't, didn't uh, need that one. No, this is the wrong one anyway. We want the Toccata and Fugue in D minor 565, I guess. Every composer is worth his salt. Now, hold up. This is, this is the one. All right, let's, let's get a, yes. Scroll past the Takata, get out of here Takata. Get out of here Takata. I'm getting rotated and hydrated. Yo, actually, a legitimate rhyme. <coughs> what up, Crumble? Get hydrated. All right, I have to listen. I have to listen to this. Prepare to see my YouTube recommended. Uh, Dakota and Fugue in D minor. Best version ever. Who the fuck cares? Uh, this is who I want. Schmollen.
messing up my my filters. Can I rotate around a different axis? Um. No, I don't think I can. <laughs> not without not without doing some serious like uh, recalculation. All right, Bach fugues. We're looking for singability. Probably for the best. That would be weird. You're right. It's it's one thing if you're uh, you know rotating around the little left upper left axis, but we don't lean right on this channel whatsoever. So uh, we would never want to rotate around a different axis than that. Um, let's uh, actually, you know what? I gotta remember that Friday is also uh, Helenum Day. Very important. Um, do I have my Helenum question? Whoa! It's so big. Why so big? What's the funniest? No, I already answered this one. Smaller, 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 smaller. How are you today, Isaac? Well, let me tell you. Yesterday, I went to a board game night because I'm a huge nerd. And uh, did you know that in Europe, uh, board games are like so complicated? I, I played one board game. It's on here. It's on here. Uh, I played one board game last night. It's called Wormspan. Uh, I played one one board game for three hours. Game length, 90 minutes? That's a lie. <laughs> Maybe if you know what you're doing. <laughs> uh, game weight, heavy. That is correct. <laughs> It's called Sorry. Yes. <laughs> the game was Sorry. And uh, it was tough. I couldn't stop apologizing. Um, like, just look look, look at this collection of, of pieces. Look at all these rules. This is, this is an accurate depiction of the setup of the game. Um, anyway, the train was slightly late. And last night, I had a dream. <clears throat> the dream was that I was late to school because the bus was late. It's like, God damn it. My, my dreams of being late to class have now combined with my dream, with my real life experience of being late on a train. And I hate it. But it's 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 cute. Look, they've got like little dragon cards, and they've got a book full of dragon. Uh, see, a dragon, thirty-two page dragon fact book. That is the that is the key draw here. I have high school dreams for some reason. But I sell my job. It is wild. But that's that's the thing, man. Like you you don't realize how deeply the fears you had in high school affected you until years later when you're like why am i still having why am i still having this stupid dream about being late to class why am i still having this stupid dream about like not being able to find my college schedule and then accidentally missing an entire semester of classes <laughs> like like oh shit i went the entire semester without ever going to like science 
oh no, how did that happen? And then you never stop to think, like, could it be a dream? It could. Anyway, what fictional character would you like to be for a day? And what would you do? All these fucking views. This one, maybe. Make the music with your mouth. A boom boom. McDuck, buy myself a house and put it in my own name. So when I'm me again, I have a house. Oh God. <laughs> that's that's the real thing. Like you got you're you're planning for for the, the after the day, right? I wanna be, you know, I wanna be Warren Buffett for for the day. And on that day, I would set up a trust fund for myself, for my other self. Isaac Anzu trust fund. Why would Warren Buffett do this? He lost his mind for 24 hours. No, he didn't. It was me. I was invading his mind. All right. Uh, grab my MIDI file. Just put it on a new. Of course, there's uh, tempo markings down here. What the, what the fuck is happening over here? Why are you so quiet? <laughs> Me and Brad Neely made a sick ass beat all mouth. Like you like. Dude. Brad Neely? Hell yeah. We stand Brad Neely. Be Warren Buffett. And open Warren's buffet. <laughs> Modern problems require. 
it's 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 actually like this is like a, a magical solution isn't it modern problems require magical solutions that's kind of just sad isn't it <laughs> now this is not a fugue is it Can we get the complete score? So yeah, this is the prelude. What is magic but science you don't understand? Listen, <laughs> if all of a sudden there was like body swapping magic, uh, people would not be using it for um, People would not be using it for, like, uh, being a fictional character for a day. Oh, wait, it's a fictional character, not Warren Buffett. Shit. Warren Buffett is not a fictional character. Damn it. Spoiled again. Um, all right, we need, we need to try... Is this just the prelude as well? version of Fox Prelude and Fugue in D minor, the fugue part. What is society coming to? Anyway, I uh, guess we'll have to do it ourselves. Get out of here, Preludia. We want Fuga. <laughs> Warren Buffet is not real. The local McDonald's is still stuck. <laughs> All right, time to answer this question, huh? What fictional character would you like to be for a day and what would you do? I, I, I like Prendel's answer. I would be someone like, I'm not gonna say Scrooge McDuck, who's another famous rich fictional character. I'd be someone like, uh, how about Doug Dimmodome? Doug Dimmodome or Scrooge McDuck and I would set up a trust fund for Isaac Anzu while I was in control of their body. <laughs> Iron Man, because money and cool access to Ooh, Iron Man's a good one. Iron Man's a good one. Oh, this is a great question. Thank you, Telling him for providing funny questions. Is that Doug Dimidome? The owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome? You dim a damn well better believe it. As a kid's show, they couldn't say that line. And, and you know, that's a shame. Uh, okay, go away. We need you to go here. This can close. Um, that's fine. So what we're going to do here is learn about fugues. Uh, so fugue is basically this melody, and then it plays twice. Um, the cool part about it is it plays over itself. So it's kind of like a round. Like if you ever sing row, row, row your boat, and then like people start like joining in later and later, 
You know, it's like that. But we don't actually need all that much. So even if even if there was a um, even if there was a, a MIDI version, we would have been cutting it way short. So we are in the key of D major. Eighth notes, good. And now I have to remember how to read music. Fuck. Uh, uh huh. What's that note? No. B. G. Uh, G and then and then another B. If alien, if you could ask aliens any question, what would it be? Aliens being kind of the stand-in for just <clears throat> some sort of insanely advanced um, species, right? Because when you think about aliens, it's not like they're going to have the answers to, like, you know, what is is, is a particular religion real or... Uh, what happens after you die? All right. <laughs> Why was Bugga Sparks ugly so legit? Do I want to know? That is my question. It's from 15 years ago. I do like that the guy had has little rats on his shoulders. Can we talk about how actually like cute and awesome rats are? Uh, rats get a bad rap when it's actually squirrels that are the true menaces to society. Uh, what's this? This is an F sharp. We can't? No. The sponsors won't allow it. You're right. Today's sponsor is classical music. Uh, if you don't have something to say about classical music, then get the fuck out of here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> if aliens come here, they can take me to a nice little planet. <laughs> yeah, if, if I, you could ask aliens any questions, what would it be? My question is, can I uh, please come with you? <laughs> May I join you, sir? Please, please, I promise I will be cool. I will not bogart the space weed. We can get space high together. got his balls cut off doesn't mean he didn't have them <laughs> right have to head to a sector over though space weed is not legal in this one knowing our luck yeah they what if what if you ask the aliens a question and it turns out they're feds 
what if you ask the aliens a question and it turns out that they are gonna turn you into the space police? Fucking narc, narc aliens. Assuming the aliens are cool, I would ask for drugs. <laughs> if you could ask aliens any question, what would it be? The balls are the size of mine. They're just dragging them bad boys all over. What else are they gonna do with them? Are you are you disturbed by animal balls? It's one of those it's one of those things maybe like people who grew up in the city, right? Is this really a three bar subject? Balls of steel. Yeah, we need to... We need to make this bad boy a longer... Solar system kids wind up the windows. <laughs> uh, Davey, we are not friends on Discord yet. Right? You have a Discord tag? I'll be your friend on Discord. But my my uh, my Discord server is not really open to the public yet. Maybe it never will be. Maybe, maybe I'll be a reclusive Discord hoarder. I'm just gonna keep keep my Discord all to myself. Ah, that's how you do it. Do you have a keyboard? Uh, oh, oh, like a piano? I do. I do like, listen, uh, if I could ask the aliens any question, what would it be? I would ask to see slash live on another habitable planet and also and maybe try some alien drugs because you know that shit must be out of this world <laughs> AOL instant messenger is where it's at my bro that the moonlight sonata written all, all over it well yeah i'm i'm kind of i'm kind of uh hmm. i'm not sure about this yet you weren't cool enough to use it when you were younger yeah i also so I grew up in that weird era of the internet where, um, like, <clears throat> you could be online, but a lot of the online spaces were still, uh, let's call it restricted to adults. Right? Bing, bing, bing. 
It only sounds like Moonlight Sonata because that's like the classical music piece. That's the one everyone knows. My family didn't have internet until 2002, 7, 8, probably for the best. I think so. Honestly, like, the children are getting internet too early. They've got the brain rot. Right? They're the iPad iPad generation. I don't like it. I've, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be boomer about this. I'm gonna be very boomer about this. But you should probably not have access to the internet until you're like... Twelve? And listen, if I was... If I was, uh... I was a big streamer my career would be over right then and there they would they would they would not um, they would not stand for it I would be done absolutely finished capito that's it no more Isaac on Zoom <laughs> my nephew was going on about skibbity riz or some crap I just owned him immediately uh, have you seen the videos? I posted one, uh, or I linked to one somewhere a little while ago. But like, brain rot fallout. Yeah, CJ Mattis. Blue goo. Blue goo. You, you saw, saw me mewing alone. Without a simp in my heart Without a yacht of my own Like it's just the entire New Vegas intro But with brain rot memes And I'll be honest It's funny as hell Look, I'm not, I'm not the type of person who's gonna Disown a meme Just because it's full of brain rot If it's funny and they're fucking funny. That's the real tragedy of it. Like, I can recognize that this is a horrible thing to happen to a child's mind. And also that it's just objectively hilarious. The, child the children are not alright. But they're also really funny. That's a shame. That is a shame. There are mixed emotions here. Okay, let's let's review. Another, another track. I love a good laugh, but it's also that kids seem to take what we see as a meme seriously. It's true. Like, people who were around pre-internet kind of see the internet as its own separate culture, right? This is real life, and them's the memes. And we love the memes. Oh, it's like... The best TV, the best movie, the best interactive media, the best video game you've ever played. But to kids, there's no difference. That is the culture. 
right? You're just, you're just like, you know, just making, making fun of it. Why? Right? All right. Um, I'm too zoomed out. Natch. Now we're going to explore the power of Zephug. And we have to scroll down a little bit, right? Because this starts on F sharp three. So this one needs to start on culture will completely take over in a few generations and that scares me well and i think the thing is like every culture every every generation and every culture have their own values right and what's interesting is you can kind of see the values forming um We're gonna turn off the, the the first part. You can kind of see the values forming already, where you've got this. I don't know. You could call it like brain rot culture, but it's already being pushed back on. You know, like the kids. The kids are already calling it brain rot. That should be a bit of a sign. Right, that. Oh, why is that? Oh, I see, I see. Like, they're not taking it quietly, essentially. They're not just, they're recognizing that there's a problem here. Um, and they're, they're, they're combating it in a way that is very internet, which is to make it funny, make it a meme, because memes have lifespans. And if you, and, and that's the thing, right? Like, like we talk about how like, oh, in a couple years, everybody will be saying skibbity. They'll be part of the lexicon. Probably not because it is a meme, right? Um, now, things like selfies or cancel culture, stuff like that, right? Those started out as memes as well, but they weren't, they, they were slang, but they weren't really like memeified, right? It was just describing a, a situation in more kind of, I don't know, naturalistic language, right? So you actually had, um, you know, people continue to use those words long after, uh, long after they, they were no longer relevant. Uh, let's see, that's a D and that's a B. Into a C sharp trill, let's go. want to uh, make fun of me because I can read bass clef better than I can read uh, treble clef. You're one, you'll be one step closer to being a true classical musician. Uh, but it's true. I played the bassoon. So reading the bass clef is not as hard for me. It's true. I'm a filthy bassoonist. Why would I? Why would I admit that on the internet? <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna ruin me. Uh, let's go down to the notes. Wouldn't make fun of you for that. I can't read any of it. You can't read this? It's so easy. No, I'm just not at all. 
It's actually one of the things that is a huge problem for classical music in general is that it is a it is a whole extra skill set just to even access the music. And and that is just a fucking tragedy. You know what I'm saying? All right, we're going to stop here. We have eight bars. So I just want, I, I'm going to, I'm going to turn off the beat for a second and pause the music. And this, this, this should, uh, this should hopefully kind of like explain a tiny bit what a fugue is. What is a fugue? What the F is a fugue? So if you listen to, um, this section, Right, right. And then you listen to this section. They're almost the same, right? This one is this one is in a different key than this one. But because it's in a different key, when you put them together, they fit on top of each other. They overlap. And then, of course, we we destroy the classical canon by putting a drum beat on it. So, dear Bach, we're done with you. I'm going to keep Bubba Sparks up just for um, a reference. You have unlimited financing to invent the most ridiculous thing you can think of. What do you make? <laughs> this is one of those very human, very human designs. A car. A car is a ridiculous object, that's for sure. All right. So what we're going to do here, uh, first off, we are going to fuck with, fuck with this a little bit. We are going to just um, get rid of that thing at the end there. So now it ends on the tonic, right? B. Yeah. We're in B minor. <laughs> I would invent a construction of four walls, a floor, and a roof for an affordable price. Crundle, are you like house hunting or something? Is this is this a cry for help? Are you crying? Are you crying, Crundle? You crying for help? Um we're gonna we're just gonna like bring me back my my shit. I have an audio plugin for this. It's called trash.adg. Now that it's nice and trashy, we can compress it.
Actually, you know what we should put on this? 10 OTTs. Just, just 10 compressors. Let's go! Actually, oh jeez, it's going. Actually, I, I kind of want to do this uh, as as two separate things. I'm sorry, it's I need I need them panned left and right. That's the problem. Surely that's the problem, and and, and nothing else I've done is the problem. I have an idea. Why are we using pianos? That's a stupid instrument. <laughs> we we should use a fucking cowbell. Where's my cowbell sound? Did T Pain fuck a Jack Skellington tree to make this? Bet. Where's my 808 cowbell? Hell fuck. More cowbell. I wasn't sure what that email was, but it's salt. You got denied a mortgage again. I'm, I'm sorry. Can I, um, can I offer you uh, a nut in these trying times? Nuts. Also, Chichin, what's up? Hey, Chichin, you have unlimited financing to invent the most ridiculous thing you can think of. What do you think? We have a car and a house. Ridiculous, ridiculous thing so far. The net does make me feel better. You, you do not? You do not have something to, to contribute? Why? <laughs> oh, uh, shit. You didn't quite hear what I asked. Uh, you have unlimited financing to invent the most ridiculous thing you can think of, is the question. Oh, no, so far we've had a car and a house. Ten... Ten decibels of gain reduction. Yeah, if you have unlimited funding. But the thing is, it has to be ridiculous, right? A car and a house are very useful objects. They're not really ridiculous, are they? Can we put 10 OTTs on the drum kit too, please? No, that, that's not what I want. Can we put trash on the drum? Portal technology. We can make it happen with infinite money. Ah, but it being a portable is...
ridiculous. I do like that. Affordable, affordable housing. Uh, JK. <laughs> Portal technology is a really good answer, actually. Um. I just need another compressor. I need I need a drum bus on these drums. Because we need to crunch ties in the cabinet. We need that boom in B minor. <laughs> that Dark Souls sex change coffin? Oh my god. Wait, you're right. Dark Souls 2 sex change coffin. That's a great answer. Actually, yes. Uh, hashtag not trans just would, would love to spend a day as the other gender. As any other gender. Let me mix and match my body parts, man. That's what, yet another reason why cyborgification can't come soon enough. Like, if I just if I just want to like switch out parts, I should be allowed to, right? It's kind of sad, but as a chimera shapeshifter, there are certain things you just can't shapeshift out, like the horns, right? I always have these horns, no matter what my shape shifting shifts my shape to. I would love to be able to just meh, take off the horns, meh, put on, I don't know, fucking any other horns. Uh, all right, let's see. JK, I'd make a sex change machine because that would be hella fun. Do you have a do you have a friend? Um, do you have a friend in your life? Because I have this friend. We have made a pact that if we were ever to switch bodies, if we were ever to wake up as each other, the first thing we would do is have sex. No questions. No time, no place. The first thing we would do is just go. I'm not gonna lie, this is starting to sound pretty slick. But can we, this closed hi-hat needs to be louder. If you had portal technology, you could also use that for sex. Just saying. <laughs> You've seen the memes, I know you have. You can't deny it. would also probably allow us to generate infinite energy. Oh, yeah, true. Because you put a portal at the bottom of the ocean and then you stick the other portal above the ocean. And then you just put a turbine on the falling water, right? Do that a hundred thousand times. 
infinite energy. Yeah, I always, so, so one of the big things that science fiction writers like to use to separate societies is energy production. And essentially, if you can get your energy to the point where you are like harnessing all the capacity of your local star, you're like a type five civilization or something like that, because your energy needs are that high, right? Artichev scale? Okay, great. Thank you for your thank you for your knowledge. Not Kardashian. Card uh Artichev scale. It's about energy consumption, not production. A type one civilization is able to access all the energy available on its planet and store it for consumption. So we're not even a type one civilization yet. Type two, consume a star's energy. Type three, all the energy emitted by its galaxy. And type four, is able to use energy comparable to the entire power of the universe. 10 to the 50th watts of power. <laughs> no portals. A North Korean hacker is gonna put your dong somewhere in the desert. Your left pity is gonna be Antarctica. Well, that's like if you're doing teleportation shenanigans, right? If you're teleporting, then uh, yeah, you gotta you gotta like really trust the teleportation system that you're using. Now, portals are an interesting. They're an interesting variation on that, right? Can we just... Can we just talk, like, cause, cause portals are more about um, matter and energy transference at a fixed point, right? I love sci-fi megastructures. A Dyson Sphere sounds impressive. I've heard of a Dyson Sphere. Have you heard of the Alderson Disc? I'm just gonna keep opening tabs if you keep bringing up stuff that I wanna read about. The Alderson Disc. A uh, hypothetical artificial astronomical megastructure. Uh, it is a giant platter with a thickness of several thousand miles. The sun rests in the hole at the center, and the hole would be surrounding, surrounded by a thousand mile high atmos atmosphere to prevent wall to prevent atmosphere from the sun. The outer room would not require a wall. Because the sun remains situated, there's no day night cycle, only a perpetual twilight. A wonderful place to stage a gothic or sword and sorcery novel. The atmosphere is right and there are real monsters. The habitable zones by humans is relatively narrow, and the disc could be shared with aliens from higher and colder planets. Over long periods of time, life forms would evolve to settle the sparsely inhabited regions in between. If civilization should, should fall, things could get eerie and interesting. Yeah, that's kind of sick. This is, this is a sick concept. I like this. <laughs> Unless the portal moves. Yeah, then you're fucked. Portals from portal, from the game portal, they do move. They do be moving. There was a documentary about portals tech. You might have heard of it. The... The... UAW on Mars created a portal? Wait, what's the UAW? UAW Mars. My favorite discussion about portal tech is how conservation of momentum breaks people's brains. Yeah, like... 
Oh no, internet? Internet? He even made a simulation you can lift in. It's called Doom! It's true. What's the, what's the UAW? The Union of Mars? Constructed World Wiki. Uh... Wait, this is awesome. Conworld.fandom slash wiki. I do hate fandom as a site. But look at this. They have maps of Mars. Or potential Mars. Income and wealth equality. Yeah, right. <laughs> One of the most intensive and developed welfare states among human beings. Yeah. UAC. Okay. The UAC Mars base. Ah. I see. It's the name of the Mars base on the Indian. They have a portal there? Uh, I'm getting so distracted. I hope this background music is out of place. Is it too loud? Is the background music currently too loud? I doubt it, right? You're not in this... You're not in this chat if you don't like a little bit of, uh... Torture. Okay. This is good. This is good. But what we need... The music is quite a bit louder than you. But... Now that should be, that should be better. We've lowered the desktop audio a, a, a smidge. This is, honestly, it's, it's just loud music. It kind of sounds like doom music a little bit, doesn't it? So, all right, time to, time to write some, some, uh, lyrics. I guess. Uh, so we're going to have two kinds of uh, lyrics here. Uh, we're going to have the um, verses in the chorus. Right. And we're going to start with the, the chorus because we're going to write the chorus to this, this rhythm. And the rhythm's pretty simple, all things considered. Uh, it's just eighth notes until you get to this, but this is a trill, so uh, then there's like a little run here and then some quarter notes and then like, yeah, just to finish it off with some more, a little run and some more eighth notes. Easy peasy. Uh, so, so, uh, what should, what should this, this rap be about? Also, the internet's fucking dying again. Damn it. Damn it! Uh, sorry. Internet still dying. Welcome back. Um, 
do you ever doubt the existence of others than you? I really don't. <laughs> I really don't. I don't because it's much easier to just assume the things that I observe do actually exist. I'm not concerned about the potential of things being a simulation or whatever. It'll be a nice it'll be a nice surprise when I die if it's true. Surprise, surprise. Next question. How should I react if my boyfriend is giving me lots of gifts early on? Milk that shit, baby. <laughs> All right. So turn off uh, the secondary thing. I mean, should we make this another diss track? Should we make this about how classical music is is not as dead as, as people think it is or as people think it should be? Should we make it about how a lot of classical music is kind of inherently uh, uh, racist and misogynist and imperialist and uh, a lot of the the great classical composers were also assholes. Can we reclaim classical music with this song? No, probably not. Let's be real. <laughs> There's no saving this. There's no saving this mess. Uh, if you you wanna show me do it to it everybody's doing then I don't know what you do uh Hmm. Oh yeah. Maybe we can make it about bus dreams. Maybe we can make it about board games. <laughs> I'm tired of drawing hands. That's the thing. That's the thing, Davey. Uh, <laughs> the, 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 the drawing hands never ends, I think. I, that, that is what I've learned from artists, is that being, being exhausted by drawing hands, just, it's not going to stop. Uh, let's make this bigger. What is our fugue rap? about bigger 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 what's our few graph about um alien technology the alderson disc the kardashev scale Look, we need more energy. We need more energy. Super civilizations, damn.
data centers and not following your dreams. You know, it's not bad. So, so, okay. Something that, something that uh, Fugue does is it wraps around on itself, right? So we kind of do want this idea of a topic that cycles. And and this idea of like failing to follow your dreams is definitely a downward spiral, right? Um it's just a day in it's just another day in your life that you're total that you're that you're it's just another day in your life that you're wasting when you can't find anything to do it's just another day in your life that you're wasting when you work when you're working for the man yo It's just another day in your life that you're wasting when you're working for the man. What's your major in? I majored in music composition. You'd think I'd be, like, better at this stuff. <laughs> I didn't major in writing, at least. Ha-ha! <laughs> Those lyrics are way too My Chemical Romance. Yeah, it's too emo, right? I want a, a downward... I don't want a downward spiral. I want, like, a power. Power spiral. Maybe, like, um... I don't know. That's cool. Am I cool? Is that really how it goes? It's a little too high, isn't it? The beat reminds you of Wankster. The fuck is Wankster? By 50 cent? Nobody... Twitch, look away. I'm gonna play Wankster. I can hear it. Music, you heard of it? Maybe that's maybe that's just what it, what it needs to be. Like, what's our fugue rap about? It's about how cool I am. It's a classic rap rap topic. Uh, 
I, I'm I'm just gonna rap about how awesome I am, how how very incredible Isaac Anzu can be, because I'm rapping like a few. But what's something? What's something that kind of like cycles, right? How about the 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 Isaac Grindzu, the grind Grindzik Anzu, Grindzik Anzu. That's what I'm gonna do. That's what it's about. It's the Grindzik. Grind, Grindzik, Anzu. That's that's the what the few graphs about. Grindzik Anzu. Uh, yeah, because the routine every day is is like repeated, right? And so uh, we're gonna we're gonna yeah. Okay, recording is back. Streaming? Hello? 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 Oh my god. Hello. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, well, that was something, wasn't it? Ooh, all right, all right. Uh, we back? Hello, hello. Hello from the other side. Uh, if I if I if I do this, all right. Let's try to replicate the problem. Fuck this. Fucking hate this. Fucking hate this. Why? Why is it working now? Okay, we back. Uh, let's see. Okay, we back. You may need to reload the page. Ugh. I hate that. I expected internet issues. I did not expect my computer to freeze. That is... I hate it. Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> Hello, seven. Thank you so much for the rain. We'll turn on the full, 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 full thing, full piece for this. What up? It's your boy Isaac Anzu. You thought he died, but he lived. I lived, bitch. Hashtag you can't say that. Uh, welcome, Keith. Welcome, Seven. Hope you had a good stream. Uh, thank you for joining. Uh, give a shout out. Uh, 
Return to Fallen 7 Vampire Players. No, that's not how you that's not how you do that. Seven the vampire. Is that even my shout out command? You are streaming The Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steer. Let's high more mids. Hello, Andy May May. We are so back! You wouldn't even know that less than five minutes ago, my entire computer crashed. We're so bad. Yo, what's up? Ooh, I love that. I love the little emo. Uh, the Shaq shimmy. Yes. Attack the invaders. Welcome, raiders. Hello, Annie Mei Mei. You're streaming Don't Starve together? Hell yeah. Um, welcome, Snick Zumi. No, don't attack the raiders! No, 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 no. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Isaac Anzu, uh, the lyrical, clerical, chimerical VTuber. Um, I've turned this horrible sound. It's still too loud. There we go. Hi, how are you? I told you to return the favor. Well, thank you so much. It's actually a huge blessing because five minutes ago, my computer entirely shut down and we had to like restart the stream and everything uh so welcome i hope you're well how's it going thank you for the raid uh today we're writing a rap song about grind Zikanzu, my my grind set well hey you're back and better than ever that's right you don't even know we left get out of here we good Okay. Uh, yeah, today we're writing we're writing rhymes. So, so, so what I need are some are some rhymes. Anybody got some good rhymes about routine and grinding? Like routine, uh, keep it clean, um, uh, stay fresh, stay mean. I'm a machine. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's a good one. Uh, how about grind on the grind? Cleanse my mind. Um, you gotta, you gotta include like, um, always on time. Give me, give me some more rhymes. We need as many rhymes as possible. They can be to these or they can be a new one. Uh, always on time. Um, grind, bind in, uh, never in a bind. Bind, kind, bind, bind, bind. Uh, the time rhyme, a classic. Lime, <laughs> climb. I don't know. I don't know how we, how you, how are you gonna make lime about grind set? Let's see, like fre fresher than a lime. Oh uh, yeah, always on time. Fresher than a lime with my rhymes, with my rhymes. Uh, routine, keep it clean, stay fresh, stay mean. I'm a machine. I'm that grind, cleanse my mind. Always on time, never in a bind. Fresher than a lime with my rhymes. Yo. It's Sunday evening. That is pre-Monday. -mon Leaves me drinking and grieving. Ooh. Actually, that's a good one. Uh, Sunday. Sunday evening. Uh, dropping all the pickup limes. <laughs> no, I can't hold all these limes. <laughs> uh, let's keep the beat going in the background while we work on this. Sunday evening, no time for 
grieving. Is that how you spell grieving? Uh, it's not. There's, there's a little, there's a little uh, rap writing tip for y'all. If you're not sure how to spell a word, just Google it. There's no shame. Sunday evening, no time for grieving, gotta. Uh, leaving, 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 right. Um, how do we make that about grind set? Uh, before the week is leaving. Well, then I rhymes. Dropping all these pickup lines. Good, good, good. Any more for machine? Routine, keep it clean, stay fresh, stay mean. I'm a machine. Uh... The rugged chrome gleam. Ooh. I stay up late since tomorrow does not start. We get the job I hate. Ooh. Okay, okay. Uh let's see. Late start. Staying up late job that I hate. Um, find my start. Uh, you know, the usual heart uh, in my heart. What's another one? Uh, restart. Art making sick slick art. Can we rhyme something with skibbity? Skibbity. Uh, rhythmically. Intrinsically. Uh. Herbal tea. <laughs> These are good. Okay. That's probably enough rhymes. So now we have to... Humpty Dumpty? Actually, wait, wait. Humpty Dumpty, like an egg I can't crack. I won't crack, like an egg I won't. Uh, unlike an egg, unlike an egg I won't crack. Always on the attack, got your back. Um, Eight hours in the sack. <laughs> is that the toilet that my boss thinks, that my Zoomer boss thinks is funny and cute? Oh, Humpty Dumpty rhyme with Skibbity. It kind of works. Skibbity, Humpty Dumpty. It kind of works. The problem is the, the emphasis is on the wrong uh syllable and you can't put the accent on the wrong syllable and make it sound weird humpty dumpty skibbity but this is this is a good this is a good lead into this this thing all right 
So now we have to take this rhythm. So it's one, two, three, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one. Just write that down. So three, two, 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 two. How many twos are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's our syllable pattern. So we need to put our stresses on those syllables. So like a three syllable word or phrase, then two, 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 four, three, one. And this three is, has a long note at the end of it. So, beam, 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 do, do, do. This first three has the accent on the second syllable. Let's go down. Uh, Machine like, maybe like machine, machine like, fresh, fresh. So, machine like, fresh and clean. I so machine like, fresh and clean. I so. Machine like fresh and clean that. So, so, okay, machine like fresh and clean eye. Do we got to rhyme with fresh somewhere? Lime, oh. Uh, Machine like fresh and clean, I'm always on time, dropping my lines. Machine like fresh and clean, I'm always on time, dropping my lines. Ooh. So how many is that? Machine like fresh and clean, I'm always on time, dropping my lines so so let's let's uh just play this for a second machine like fresh and clean i always on time dropping my lines and you can't get in me okay machine like fresh and clean i'm always on time dropping my lines that my lines is the first part of the four so, uh, dropping my lines, always on time. Uh, so, dropping my lines, so I'm like an egg. Uh, my boss is a Humpty Dumpty. Gen Z fell off the wall with the motherfucking sucking balls. This dude is offended by comedy. I can tell he never spoke to me. Oh, my friends. Good lines. I, am, I, am I just copying the Zar Khan with my rap writing stream? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time dropping my lines. So I, I want something really to end this four syllable group. And then let's see, Humpty Dumpty. I feel like Humpty Dumpty can come, come next. 
How about how about rhythmically? Rhythmically, yeah. Rhythmically, always on time, dropping my lens. Grinding, rhythmic, grinding, grinding, grinding is good. Grinding is two syllables. Okay, okay, good, good. Uh, uh, hmm. Grinding, finding. My flow grinding, finding my flow. Machine like, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. And when we put that into here, uh, it sounds like this. Machine like fresh and clean, I'm always on time dropping my lines grinding, finding my flow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Good, good, good. Grinding, finding my flow. Um uh, now we have this. So flow is this note. So now we have do 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 ba. So we have this section. Do 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 Grind and find in my flow. Intrinsically. Intrinsically, I'm, I'm rhythmically. Intrinsically, rhythmically. Skibbity. Skibbity. Skibbity is only three syllables, though. Herbal tea. How do we how do we fit three syllables in here? Or maybe here? Skibbity rhythmically. Oh man, skibbity is so hard to work in here. Almost like it's a nonsense word. Rudimentary. Oh fuck. Wait, that's a good one. Rudimentary. Rudimentary. Rudimentary rudimentary so you can pronounce that as five or three so maybe ooh yeah maybe maybe we can fit it here it's rudimentary and skibbity do 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 It's rudimentary, not skibbity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. Not now skibbity, not skibbity. Can we, uh, my own clean, I'm always on time dropping. My lines grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, no skibbity. Unlike 
an egg. I, I won't crack, crack. Yeah, 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 yeah. You did a good, good, good job. Head pats for Crundle. Betrays everything for profits. We couldn't give two shits. We are boys out in the yard. Same idea as mine. We built this company. The trust in our teammates is hard, obviously. Mm. Wait, wait, give me a second. Give me a second. I can, I can, I can make it flow. Betrays everything for profits. We couldn't give two shits. We are boys out in the yard. Same idea as mine. We built this company. The trust in our teammates is Todd. Obviously. Right? Ooh. Say, Davey. You got some, you got some, you got some good instincts in this rap writing shit. I'm always trying, and my line's grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack a Humpty Dumpty laughing. I'm skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. It's Humpty Dumpty lacking. Yeah, 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 yeah. Skibbity, I'm no egg, I won't crack. I'm no egg, I won't crack. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg, I won't crack. Ba do 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 do. Ba do ba do 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 do. I'm on that Humpty Dumpty shit. I'm on that hump. Wait. I'm on that Humpty Dumpty shit. I I'm on that hump. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Rudimentary, skibbity, we use these. Yes, yes, yes. It's rudimentary. I'm no egg, I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. No egg, I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Uh, I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Uh, I got your back. I got your. And it rhymes with crack. Okay. So we've got this. Machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time dropping. My lines grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. I, I got your back. All right. Now comes the hard part. So, so we have we have the same we have the same melody but in a different uh, key. So what we do is if this is our um, so it's it's the it's the first first melody, right? Which would technically be called the subject of the fugue. This is our answer. So 
We have to cut a little bit out here. Machine my fresh and clean. I'm always on time dropping. My lines grinding, finding my phone. I got your back. So, so, okay. So grind and find in my flow is going to be the same. But so what's going to happen here is the first, the first one is going to say, I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Uh, and then the second person could say, I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. But then we've got, I've got your back. I got your back. Uh, we didn't make rhymes for Humpty Dumpty shit, did we? Uh, what's some rhymes for shit? What's some rhymes for shit? Hit, hit me. Let's see. Uh, hit, quit. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. Actually, quit is really good. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, I'm off the Humpty Dumpty shit. I'm always on it. Never quit. Yeah, yeah. I'm always on it. Never quit. I got your, I got your back. Um, I got your back on the attack. But maybe we should switch these, right? I got your back is a better ending line. So essentially what it'll sound like is while this person is saying it's rudimentary, not skibbity, I'm no egg, I won't crack. This person will be like machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on my time on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. And then right after that, uh I'm off I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. I'm always on it, never quit. On the attack, I got your back. Like that. That's fugal rapping, motherfucker. So now we need to record this. Uh, now we need to record this. No, don't mix the audio with with that. All right. Um, hands off. We're gonna have to deal with with the heat for a second here. Uh, let's see. X in recording on this track. Um, looping. Turn off the second track. All right. Am I am I am I picking up on the mic? Yes. Okay. Cool. 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 I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. On the attack. Machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time. Dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. On the attack again, machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg, I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. On the attack. 
Machine life, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, not skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit. On the attack. I like that. All right. Uh, we need another audio channel now. So now, mute that shit, mute that shit, turn on this shit. Record onto this channel. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Fresh and clean, I'm always dropping. My heart's grinding, finding, finding my flow. Quick. I got your back. Yeah, that flow part is pretty quick. Let's see if we can get it. Machine life, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. I'm always on it, never quit. I got your back. Yeah, 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 okay. Let's do a few takes, get it nice and funky. fucking miss my entrance. How should I react if my boyfriend is giving me lots of gifts early on? I don't know. Exploit. Discombobulate. <laughs> Alright, mindset. Grind set. Machine life, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. I'm always on and never quit. I got your back. Machine life, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. I'm always on and never quit. I got your back. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. So first things first, let's uh, schmove up this audio, shall we? Uh. Yeah, the other thing is it's not going to quite line up. So I think my I think my offset here is negative 275 milliseconds. At least that's what it was uh you know, last time that I did this. It could change. We're going to take it one step at a time. Just a quick cleanup of the audio getting rid of breaths and random talking. All right, uh, let's listen to this one at a time. Bush, expression, clean, I'm always on time. Right. Um, let's add the Basic rap vocal rack. Machine life, fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, no skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. I'm a no egg. I won't crack. I'm off that Humpty Dumpty shit on the attack. Good, good. 275 seems to be right. Uh, so now on this, we also need the rap basic vocal chain here. Louder. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. I'm always 
lose on and never quit. I got your back. All right. So now what we do is time time for time for power. Time for time for real power. Uh vocode that shit. Um external from Cowbell 808. So let's just solo this. We need the unvoiced loud. We need the depth low. Egg. Am I doing this the wrong way? Maybe. Um, group me up. Okay. Vocoder. The carrier is going to be six audio. Let's try this. Finding my flow. It's rudimentary. No skibbity. No egg. I won't crack. Yeah, just a long release. Machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my lines, grinding, finding my flow. It's rudimentary, no skibbity. I'm no egg. I won't crack. I'm off at Humpty Dumpty shit on the attack. Machine like fresh and clean. I'm always on time, dropping my finding, finding my flush. It's right like fresh and clean. I'm all I'm no egg. Fine. There's machine like. Oh shit! I need to.
That'll help. <laughs> Change the compressor settings. Yeah, this is intense. And I mean, that's that's a fugal rap, right? That is 100% fugal and 100% rap, right? Um, let's just throw some... So what I want to do now is, uh, yeah, we can we can group these up because this is essentially the vocal track now. But we can take these, uh, duplicate them, move them out of the vocal track, delete the vocoder, uh, regroup them, make this like negative twelve.
And then let's just reverse reverse these, huh? Now, what do we put on this? Now, the other thing is, the other thing is we did, we did bring this down. So what if we just shift both of these up so that they're a little bit more sparkly and not, um, Hell yeah, hell yeah. Okay, chorus, <laughs> done. It only took three and a half hours <laughs> to write some fugal, fugal raps. Uh, but don't worry, we've got more to write. And I know just how to do it. Remember those MIDI files I downloaded of the prelude? Yeah, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Oh God, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, no, no tempo or arrangement shit in here. What I'm going to do, so I'm going to uh, once again duplicate this group so that we have our cowbell, our cowbell sounds uh, rip rare and ready to go. And then we're just going to scooch these in here. This will be the, the cowbells. Uh, that'll be the box. This will be <gasps> something else entirely. So what we've got here What we've got here is a bass line of sorts. Oh yeah, perfect. Uh, so now we've got this, let, let me just tell this. Super wide. Kind of, kind of computery sound.
so we've got the prelude now as our kind of like background track. So now we write the verse. <laughs> we got the chorus. So so how I want to do this is it's going to be pretty pretty easy actually. We're going to kind of do a fugue as well. So we're just going to write some lyrics and then we're going to try to make the first the first word of each lyric, like really strong, like start. Um, art, part, restart. Yeah. Um, start with a strong routine. Start with a strong routine. Art in my mind like that. Rugged chrome gleam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Heart beating mean. Isaac Anzu. Grind, Grindzik Anzu a machine. Uh, restart the next day. Restart the next day. Um, no time for grieving. Good, 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 good. All right. Uh, then we need, we need another strong set. And so maybe, um, this one, mind, binding, uh lines rhymes cool cool mind always on the attack Mind always on the attack. Uh, yeah, we don't, we're not going to use those anymore. Art in my mind, like that rugged clone green, gleaming heart beating mean. Grinds a gonzo is a machine. Restart the next day. No time for grieving. Mind always on the attack. 
binding my binding my soul to that job I hate. Lines that I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. Lines that I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. Yep. Rhymes that uh Rhymes that compel me staying up late. Rhymes that compel me staying up late. All right. So let me let me let me see if this this works. So we've got this eight bars. Start with the strong routine. Art in my mind, that rugged chrome gleaming heart be mean. Grinds a gonzo a machine. We start the next day, no time for grieving. Start strong routine. Art in my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming heart beating mean. Grinds a gonzo a machine. We start the next day, no time for grieving. Heart, art, heart. We start with the routine. In my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming beating mean. Grinds a gonzo a machine. Again, no time for grieving. Mean. Art in my mind, like the world going green and hard. What do you mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. This this will work. This idea I have will work. Uh, so goodbye. That we need new audio track. Oh, the audio checks all the way down here. I see, I see, I see. Um, throw my basic rap vocal chain. So let me let me figure out exactly what I want to do with this before we start recording. Art. Oh. Heart. Restart. Start. Art. Heart. Restart. With the strong routine. In my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Beating me, grinds Kanzu, a machine. The next day, no time for grieving with the strong routine. In my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming, beating me, grinds a kanzu a machine. The next day, no time for grieving. Yeah, yeah, okay. I think I I think I know what I think I know what I want to do here. So we actually have a lot of material. Uh accidentally. So we can take all of this and just duplicate it. So we are going to do this first verse, second verse. 
And then maybe maybe we do start with just the base and then we add in the the upper part of the prelude in the second half. So I'm gonna do here. I think I can do this in one take. I just gotta get the I just gotta get the flow, right? Start. Art. Heart. Restart. With a strong routine. In my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Beating mean, grinds like I'm a machine. The next day, no time for grieving. With the strong routine. In my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Beating mean, grinds like I'm a machine. The next day, no time for grieving. Start. Art. Heart. Restart. Good enough. Then we need a, another, we need to duplicate this. We need another audio track. Uh, I need to record onto this one now. And we need to do essentially almost the same thing. Start. Art. Heart. Restart with the strong routine. In my mind, look that rugged chrome gleaming, beating mean, grinds a gonzo a machine. The next day, no time for grieving. <gasps> Hi, Isaac. Hi, Ray. Good to see ya. <laughs> Fart. Yeah, you bet. That's exactly what it that's exactly what we needed. Art, finally. Uh, okay. Yes, 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 good. Um, delay the track because my microphone needs it. And then, boom, 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 boom. How are you, Ray? Uh, I'm writing fugal raps. <gasps> the fugist, the fugal of raps. What the fuck is a fugue, you might ask? Well, it's when a melody is able to uh, be layered on top of itself in a subject and answer or subject and counter subject sort of way. It's fine. Seems like you're doing a Death Grips style of rap. You know, you ain't wrong. It doesn't make you right. The drums are not nearly as too, as complex as, as Death Grips. This is actually just like your bog standard drum track, straight out of the box, straight out of the Ableton box. I'm, I'm a fake, I'm a fake, I'm a fake. All right, clean up this audio track. Make sure that is extended so that we don't lose the last word there. So we actually have two different styles of fugal rap here. We've got a fugue in the style of J.S. Bach or Mr. Johann Sebastian Bach if you will. And then we have a kind of kind of kind of more interesting uh conceptually call and response sort of rap. Uh okay. So here's how it sounds. In my 
my mind, but that rugged chrome gleaming. Feeding me, grinds like I'm to a machine. The next day, no time for grieving. Start with the strong routine. Heart in my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Heart beating me, grinds like I'm to a machine. Restart the next day, no time for grieving. Start with the strong routine. Heart in my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Heart beating me, grinds like I'm to a machine. Restart the next day, no time for grieving. Start. Did it cut off a little? It cut off a little. All right. So we also want to differentiate these voices. Uh, so obviously we're just going to like uh, trash the shit out of them like we did with the chorus. Here's the chorus, by the way. goes hard thank you turns out that fugues can be fun Start. too hard. Hard. Restart. oh shit no not what i wanted to do with a strong routine we do need to make it louder mind, but, but not just by doubling it please Strong routine. Art in my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Heart beating me, grinds like I'm to a machine. Restart the next day, no time for grieving. Start with the strong routine. Art in my mind, like that rugged chrome gleaming. Heart beating me, grinds like I'm to a machine. Restart the next day, no time for grief. Wait a minute. It reminds me of my favorite internet musical animatic. Threnity? Are you fucking kidding me? They made an animatic for Threnity? Uh, I have to find this now. Is one of these the one that you're talking about? Remember the song you've shared before? No, I, I can't say I do, actually. <laughs> remind me. Please remind me. I want to know what you're fucking talking about. It's a series called Threnody. A series called Threnody. One of them, yes, Nim is the first episode. Nim. Nim. Part one. Nim. Introducing Threnody, a musical metaphor packed voyage through my experience of borderline personality disorder. Oh, that's cool. Threnody has fugues. Uh... Enjoy untangling the spider web of a story which was originally made as a gift for a love I have now lost. That's cool. It's on my check out after the stream list now.
Ага, ага. Let me share it on Discord for a bit. Please do. It sounds sounds fucking fascinating. I would love to love to check it out. All right, I think this sounds good. Does it jam with? Does it jam with the chorus? It, it kind of does, actually. Okay. Absolutely sick. I love it. So now we do the same thing, but the other direction. Uh, it's that music share. Thank you, Ray. Uh, time to do from the other direction. And let's just get... Let's get the rhythm down. Mind. Binding. Lines. Rhymes. Mind always on the attack. Binding. My soul to the job that I hate. Lines. Can I describe when I'm hitting the sack? Rhymes that compel me. Staying up late, mind always on the attack. Binding my soul to the job that I hate. Lines that describe when I'm hitting the sack. Rhymes compel me, staying up late. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate. That I scribe when I'm staying ahead. That compel me, staying up late. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate, that I scribe when I'm hitting the sack, that compel me staying up late. All right, all right, all right, all right, cool, cool. Uh, here, one, two. Mind, binding, lines, rhymes. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate. That I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. That compel me staying up late. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate. That I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. That compel me staying up late. Mind. Binding. Lines, rhymes. Good, good enough. And then we do this one. Make sure to mute that so I don't think about it. And same thing. Mind, binding. Lines, rhymes, always on the attack, my soul to the job that I hate, that I scribe when I'm hitting the sack, that compel me staying up late. Good, 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 okay, clean that shit up. Uh-huh. So what are you working on? Deforesting with fires and axe in Minecraft. <sighs> the last time I played Minecraft, I was on a server that had a no fire spreading policy. 
And I totally understand. I totally understand the no fire spreading policy. Like, it's such the most common way to grieve, right? And you just, you're setting your server up for failure. If you're just letting people throw fire wherever they want. But damn it, I was trying to, I was trying to clear a forest. And, and the forest was like, growing back at an insane rate. It was a jungle actually. Uh it was it was it was rather frustrating actually. It's rather frustrating actually to have to go through that forest bit by bit and step by step making all the acts prep I did ridiculous. I did ridiculous. I did ridiculous. Ooh, ah, ridiculously good. Ooh. Ah, uh, in the hood with my wood. Everybody's working on trees. Isaac Anzu wants to freeze. The fire's in place, but they won't let him. Everybody's out to get him. He's the number one chimera and the number one deforester. Everyone's a chorister, chorister when they're in the north. -er. North, south, east, and west. Fire held to my mom's breast. Wait. That got a little Freudian there. Let's just pretend that never happened. Uh, <laughs> you know, one of the things that's cool about improv and freestyling and all that sort of stuff is just stuff comes out of your mouth and you're like, huh, that's phallic or that's weird or I don't want to think about that stuff. And you just kind of have to accept that it happens. It's okay. Let's never speak of it again. <laughs> All right. Time to solo this and listen to the vocal comping and see if I did a good job. You know, with both things turned on. Is that mind? Mind. 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 Yeah, these S's I cut off accidentally. Cut off that T too short. My soul is the job that I hate. That is crap when I'm hitting the sack. Sack. That is crap when I'm hitting the sack. That compel me staying up late. Mine always on the attack. Find it. My soul is the job that I hate. Mine. That is crap when I'm hitting. Yeah, I think I, I think I cut off uh, a lot of these too early. That's okay, though. Mine always on the attack. Mine always on the attack. Mine is my soul to the job that I hate. Mine that is crap when I'm hitting the sack. Mine that compel me staying up late. Mine always on the attack. Mine is my soul to the job that I hate. Mine that is crap when I'm hitting the sack. Hitting the sack when I'm hitting my sack. Don't hit your sack too much, kids. Line that I cry when I'm hitting the sack. Rise that compel me staying up late. Lies. Okay, good, 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 good. Now, I think it's done somehow. Art. In 
rugged, chrome, gleaming, heart beating me. Rides a gonzo or machine. Restart the next day. No time for griefing. Start with a strong routine. Heart in my mind, look that rugged, chrome, gleaming, heart beating me. Rides a gonzo or machine. Restart the next day. No time for griefing. Yeah, I think maybe this might be too Lies. high. Always on the attack. My soul to the mind. Always on the attack. I got your back. Mind. Finding. Lies. Rhymes. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate. That I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. That compel me, staying up late. Mine. Always on the attack. Find it. My soul to the. Mine. Always on the attack. My soul to the job that I hate. Run. That I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. Run. That compel me. Say it up late. Mine. Always on the attack. Find it. My soul to the job that I hate. Line. That I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. Run. That compel me. Say it up late. One more thing. Heart oh god, the internet is dying. Me. Heart beating me. about restarting is convincing the internet. No! No!
Excuse me? Is this the only uh, thing here going on? Mind. All right. This is shit. We need. We need the wider. We need the wider plug in. And give me the compressor. Attack. Binding my soul to the job that I hate. Line that I drop when I'm hit. Let's just shave off a little. My soul to the job that I hate. Lie that I drive when I'm hitting the sack. Come on, Internet. I believe in you. Finding lies, 
soul to the job that I hate. Then I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. That compel me, staying up late. Mine, always on the attack. Bind my soul to the job that I hate. Mine, that I scribe when I'm hitting the sack. Rhyme, that compel me, staying up late. Mine, always on the attack. Digging it, digging it. Grind the is good enough as a title for this. had a song where I didn't have to On internet, I believe in you. Don't quit on me now. I need to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Too much in the 10k, you see.
Now, should we do something with this? I mean, I'm, I'm digging it overall. I mean, I, I kind of like it. Let's see how it ends. Yeah. All right. That's it. The fugal rap is done. Uh. Yeah. Fugal rap project. But really what we're gonna call it is Grindzik Anzu. That's the title. I titled the song and it broke my internet again. <laughs> Yippee, another victory for the great Isaac. Let's go! Dun 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 dun. Are y'all ready for this? Ayo, ayo, ayo. Y'all ready for ayo? This ayo. Ray, maybe you can tell us why is Gen Z humor so funny? Why is it so funny? Lyrics are done. Track is exported. Uh, let's go to SoundCloud. <gasps> Behind the scenes. With the rap machine. Upload. Uh, I don't know. It happens. They just, they just are actually good. They are actually good at making memes. All right, copy the lyrics. Yes. A rap in the form of a fugue, specifically a prelude and fugue in B minor by Johann Sebastian Bach. Uh, what was the, what was that? 
BWV869. Nice. BWV869. I'm more of a millennial kid. That is definitely where I get my... Um... Can we do custom? Classical rap. Add tags. Rap. Uh, classical. Classical. What'd you call this? Um, EDM. Horny music. Henry music. Grinding music. You've deforested everything. You've become the overlord of deforestation. Um, let's collect all and save here. Good. And then I can delete these MIDI files. Get out of here. Uh, lyrics can be going away. Uh, upload an image. We'll just do the Rob Zombie Isaac since it's really rap, classical, EDM, uh, hyper rap, um, funk. Um, is it possible to make horny Christian music? Yes always possible caption caption start the conversation with your SoundCloud community by adding a caption to your post the caption allows you to express what you're feeling in the moment when posting a track it will be shown to followers in the feed oh i see i see uh my caption is was it a mistake to combine rap and classical music and fugues and hyper pop and funk and uh, about 100 OTTs. Uh, dot, 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 dot. Yes. <laughs> metadata contains music my god creative commons share like get a dunk permissions sure advanced no i'll have to pay for that rap and classical is what a british rapper would do i think you would think so You would think so. Imagine rapping to the flow of Mozart. Bro, it's like you don't even check out my SoundCloud. It's like you don't even know what I did. The rap a la Turca. I did this. Why is it so quiet? And here's Grinds of Gonzo. It's 
fascinating. Fascinating. All right. I think we have to stop here because before the internet dies, I do want to actually try to raise someone. Who would appreciate what I've done here? I think Nukia Punch would appreciate what I've done here. Also playing Hades. Super cool, super cool. All right, we're gonna raid Nukia Punch. If somehow you manage to survive uh, this entire time, despite all the, what the, what the fuck, whatever the fuck happened. If you survive, join me. Copy that raid message. Let's go say hi to Nukia. One, two, three, four. My name's Isaac Ansu. I'm always on the grind suit. I never want to stop. I'm always going to be on top. Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Uh, thank you so much for joining. My name's Isaac Ansu. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let those bit points fight. Uh, we can let the song end here.